Hey, what's going on YouTube? So it's Nathan back here with another one bringing to you a new video. So today I'm back here with a new streaming app. I'm gonna definitely bring this to you. It's got over 250 plus channels. And definitely if you like to watch your sports, movies, TV shows all for free, definitely stay tuned for the name of this app. So let's go ahead and dive right into it. We're gonna go ahead and go to the Amazon Fire Stick. In here, we're gonna go ahead and once again, search for an app. I always search for these apps. If we click on search, we just type in here X, you and as you type that in xu xumo comes up and if you click on eczema so i was just checking out apps to see what has been updated what has changed what's new on the amazon fire stick so i stumbled upon this eczema play it used to be called eczema but now it goes by eczema play they got a brand new interface so let's go ahead and check out this interface see what movies tv shows and live tv channels they have all right so once we're in here we just want to click on the download button Go ahead and download that begin the process so it can install on your amazon fire stick or fire tv so once you have done that all right so once that's finished you want to go ahead and open this up so let's go ahead and jump into the app it may take a while because when i first opened this app it took about i guess a minute or so of like a full 60 seconds for the app to load because there was so much content in here so definitely give it the proper amount of time to load on your device and then that way we can proceed with the content, the free movies, TV shows, live TV. And it's already been about 20 seconds and we're still waiting for the app to load, but I promise you it does deliver. So it finally just loaded up. It immediately comes up to the live TV guide section where you can browse all the channels that they have. They are promoting the NFL right now because they just recently added the NFL channel to it and they're broadcasting the NFL drive. And this is all completely for free. If you don't believe me, let's go and jump over to their website really quick and then we'll get into the live TV guide and the rest of the app. All right, so we went to eczema.com. This is what it comes up. It comes up to the live TV guide as well immediately if you go to their website directly and you have a few items in here, but we're looking for something specific. We're looking for the FAQs. So let's click on the FAQs down here at the bottom and we just wanna find out some information. So it says here, what is Eximo? Eximo Play is your destination for free live and on-demand streaming entertainment with over 290 different channels. It says here with over 290 different channels and tens of thousands of movies and TV show titles to choose from and you won't get bored. So that says a lot. Also down here, let's see what it says about the subscription. So XML Play, as you know, is free and ad supported. So once again, in turn for your service of watching the ad, you get to watch the content for free. So it says here, all Eximo Play channels and Eximo powered applications are completely free to watch and stream from any device. So that pretty much confirms that it is free. I'm just going over this mainly because YouTube likes to crack down providing free content. I'm just confirming to YouTube, the algorithm, the robots that scan these videos that this is 100% completely free. Also, just another follow-up of information here. Let's see. All right, here, just to confirm here, once again, it says here, why does XML Play have commercials? XML Play has commercials or ad breaks so that we can keep our service available for free for viewers like you. So that confirms that this is 100% completely free. This is XML.com. Let's go and jump back over to the Fire Stick and jump back into the app to see what we missed over there. So let's see, we have all these live TV channels and also on the left-hand side, if we scroll here, you are met with some categories here. So you got a recommended section, you got my favorites. If you wanted to favorite an item, you just hover over the item and there's these hearts on the left-hand side over the logo of the network. So if you click on that heart, it'll then show in your favorites. Also, they have different categories for news, nature, weather, movies, sports. I know a lot of people watch my videos for the sports. This is the sports section here. Once again, they got the NFL Network broadcasting the NFL Draft completely for free. You got basketball, you got cornhole, snowboarding, pool, CBS Sports, Campus, Fox Sports, Fifth Gear, Golf Pass, Motor Vision, Motor Trend, Nitro Circus, Original Sports, Outdoor America, Outside, looks like here, PGA Tour, Insider, Poker, po Power Nation, Pursuit Up, Racing, Spartan TV, the list goes on of multiple different channels that they have, and those are just your sports sections. If you go to different various other channels, like Westerns or Horror, Comedy, Action, they have a ton of different content for everybody 
Um, also, if we go to the live TV guide just one more time, so I wanted to hover over the recommended section one more time. If I hover over the recommended section, these are all the top channels that people watch the most on this service or platform. So you got ABC News, Dateline, you got ION, you got MSNBC, UFC, CBS, Court TV, you got Coindesk, and then it kind of goes into the the different categories once again. So this is the news section. So you're going to get all your mainstream news, all your weather. They did have the weather channel in here, but I did notice that it was Espanol only. Um, but Fox Weather is plenty enough for news as far as like weather goes. But there's a ton of content in here for live TV channels. Once again, there's 290 different channels that you can check out in here. And that's only for the live TV section. For the free movies and TV shows, that's a whole different ballgame. So if you were looking for a specific networks like ABC, you can branch out and kind of search by network. If you just want to see like specific news or NFL or anything that you're into, UFC, you're looking for specific content that you want to drill down into, definitely use the network category section on the left hand side you just get there by going all the way to the left and it'll hover over this far left hand pane or menu that you can move up and down there's only four options live tv free movies tv shows and networks we click on the free movies i thought the free movie selection was pretty decent um they had some pretty well-known movies in here most services do but they had a lot more than what i expected so I'm just clicking my down arrow and just so you can see what types of content they have, what relevant movies they have, and if it's worth a download based on the movie selection or the live TV section. But once again, I think it's pretty decent. Let me know what your thoughts are in the comment section below. If this is pretty decent, do you like the update or did you like the old version better? Um, definitely let me know. And then as for the TV shows, let's see what TV shows they have in here. Most of the time, these TV shows will be like super old, um, so that's what I'm seeing here. I don't see anything of uh, recent relevance. All right, so once again, this is Eximo. If you're not sure what Eximo is, this is a free streaming ad supported platform. Once again, the service is completely free because they deliver ads to you in exchange for your service of watching the ad. They give you the content for free. So it's a nice transaction between the customer and the company and the platform. But that's how you find that app. Also, once you download it, the way you find it, you just come down here to the recently used apps or you can come up here and go to the right and click on the three squares with the plus sign. And you'll find that app right here at the bottom of the list where it says Eximo Play. You can click the three lines on your remote to move it up or move it just in general to a place where you can see it. So if you want to move it to one of your quick tiles, that's more than welcome. And you can change that just by clicking. So once I've confirmed that I've moved that into the right location where I wanted it, it's now on the fourth tile on the Amazon Fire Stick home screen. So once again, thank you so much for watching this video. Give it a like, comment, subscribe. If this was helpful to you in any way, let me know down in the comment section below. And once again, thank you so much for watching and you have a great day. Peace.